Here are 15 things you may have learned in school that have since been proven wrong. Myth. Ostriches hide their heads in the sand. Even to this day many kids grow up thinking that ostriches bury their heads in the sand because they believe that if they can not see a predator it can not see them. Ostriches have tiny heads that sometimes appear to submerge when they are pecking at the ground and they actually do briefly put their heads in the ground to turn their buried eggs. But the ostrich did not evolve with the worst defensive survival strategy in the animal kingdom. Myth. Chameleons change colors to camouflage themselves. In pop culture chameleons are thought of as spiky lizards that change their skin to fit any color or pattern in their surroundings. This belief makes them metaphors for things like disguisable military technology and talented actors. But while their color-changing abilities are prodigious they mostly use it to maintain a certain body temperature and as a way to communicate with other chameleons not to hide from predators. In any case cuttlefish are much better at changing colors to fit their surroundings. Myth. You can only taste certain things on certain parts of your tongue. According to the tongue map myth different parts of your tongue are for different sorts of tastes. The back of your tongue detects bitter tastes the front takes in sweet tastes and so on. This is wrong. Taste receptors are all over your tongue and they all pick up all kinds of tastes. It is true that some taste buds are more receptive to certain kinds of tastes than others but the difference is slight according to the University of Florida Center for Smell and Taste and the locations of those taste buds aren't in accordance with the tongue map. Myth. Sir Isaac Newton discovered gravity when an apple fell on his head. Newton's apple legend is not true but like many urban legends it is an embellished version of something that actually happened. An apple didn't fall on Newton's head but Newton did start theorizing about gravity when he saw an apple falling from a tree and started thinking about it. Myth. Albert Einstein failed math in school and was a terrible student, it is an attractive idea for young kids. Maybe you're bad at school but you can still bloom as a genius later in life. While examples of late blooming talents are everywhere Einstein did not one. He was an excellent student in math and everything else, when he was younger. The myth that he flunked a math class may be from when he failed the entrance exam to the Zurich Polytechnic. But he was still a couple of years from graduating high school at the time and he didn't speak a lot of French the language the exam was given in. Furthermore he passed the mathematics section but failed the language botany and zoology sections. There are many other myths about Einstein that are untrue. For example he learned to read early, not late, in life and he probably didn't have a learning disability. Myth. Diamonds are made from ultra-pressurized coal. Both coal and diamonds are formed from carbon under the surface of the earth which is where the myth comes from. But the carbon that forms diamonds is much more pure and the process requires much more heat and pressure. Myth. Pluto is no longer considered a planet. The International Astronomical Union, the scientific body that decides the scientific definition of a planet and stuff like that, originally classified Pluto as the ninth planet that orbits the Sun. In 2005 Eris another really big space rock that orbits the Sun was discovered, it is 27% larger than Pluto so it sent the IAU back to the drawing board to decide what a planet actually is. The IAU ended up with criteria that neither Pluto nor Eris met so neither could be one of the major planets that go around the Sun. Instead the two are considered dwarf planets. So yes Pluto is a planet it is just a dwarf planet. Myth. The Great Wall of China is the only man-made structure that can be seen from space. First of all it is worth noting that while man-made structures like the Great Wall are visible from satellites orbiting Earth they are not visible at all from say the Moon. The only thing you can see from the Moon is a beautiful sphere mostly white some blue and patches of yellow and every once in a while some green vegetation Apollo 12 astronaut Alan Bean told NASA. No man-made object is visible at this scale. Secondly the structures you can see largely depend on the weather and how far from our planet you actually are. In 2003 a Chinese astronaut even admitted he couldn't see the Great Wall from space because the weather conditions weren't right. Given the proper conditions astronauts in the International Space Station can see major cities the Great Pyramids of Giza and some big bridges from space. Myth. Tilting your head back will stop a nosebleed. When you were younger you might have been taught to tilt your head back in order to stop a nosebleed, but doctors agree that this is not the solution. In the case of a nosebleed do not tilt your head back like Rachel did in Friends. Instead you should tilt your head forward and pinch right below the bridge of your nose to stop the flow of blood rushing out of your nostrils. Tilting your head back doesn't actually cause the nosebleed to cease and it might lead to more damage. It can cause blood to enter your throat which leads to your stomach and further unpleasant complications. Myth. Camels store water in their humps. You might have been taught that the purpose of a camel's hump is to store water but this is not true. Some camels have one hump while others have two but regardless of quantity they serve the same purpose, to store fat. The stored fat serves as a substitute for food when camels are traveling long distances with limited available resources. According to Animal Planet a camel can use the fat as an energy source to replace approximately three weeks of food, it is actually a camel's red blood cells that account for this animal's ability to last one week without water. Unlike other creatures a camel has oval-shaped blood cells that are more flexible and enable them to store large portions of water. 
myth, you must drink eight glasses of water a day. The origin of this myth is not entirely clear but it is believed that people were convinced of this health rule after the Food and Drug Administration suggested the guideline in a 1945 published paper. If you heard this rule from a doctor family member or teacher you probably believed it was an essential rule to abide by. The truth is that you don't need need to drink eight glasses of water each day. Your body will still receive necessary hydration from other fluids and foods, it is probably best to drink a healthy amount of water and indulge in a moderate amount of less healthy beverages like sugary ones. The most important thing is remembering that your body needs to maintain a balance since fluids are constantly entering and leaving the body. The amount of hydration needed also varies from person to person since there are factors like age health conditions and activity level to take into consideration. Myth There is no gravity in space, it is common knowledge that astronauts float because there is no gravity in space. Actually there is gravity everywhere including space including the kind that keeps the moon in orbit around Earth. People and objects appear to float while in orbit because they are in a state of freefall. Myth. You will need advanced maths in life. Year after year legions of kids, many of whom aren't mathematically inclined, are forced to suffer through the chores of algebra geometry and trigonometry with the presumption multiplying numbers against letters in parentheses is necessary to hack it in the adult world. In reality fewer than 1 in 4 Americans regularly performs anything above basic math at work. Myth. Water towers store drinking water. It is true that some water towers store drinking water but even in those cases the main function of a water tower is to create water pressure. Most drinking water comes from wells reservoirs lakes or rivers. The reason water rushes out when you turn on your faucet is because massive stores of water in vertical gravity fed water towers apply enough pressure to force water to flow through your municipality's network of underground pipes leading to your house. Myth. There's a 5 second rule that applies to food that falls on the floor. If you've ever dropped a piece of food on the floor and quickly picked it up within 5 seconds deeming it safe to eat you have been misguided by a popular health myth. According to the 5 second rule food that falls on the floor is acceptable to consume, as long as it hasn't stayed on the unclean surface for more than 5 seconds. Research has found that the rule is not accurate or applicable. The longer dropped food stays on a surface the more germs it attracts but regardless food will instantly become contaminated as soon as it touches the floor.